My heart went away in 1986 when my son was killed. What a year. My son was killed right in front of my eyes by other children who called him Umjwembe. Young little boys his age. He was only 14 years old and these were his own friends. He had mentioned to his sister one day that him and Kumalo's son, Utibenju, had had a fight about which group to join between Azapo and UDF. And then suddenly, these kids came to my house looking for him, saying that they wanted him to join them for soccer. He was not home. And I asked them if they only wanted him for soccer, why they carried a tire with his name on it. They said that they only wanted to give him the tire as a present so that he could play with it. These are just some of the images that haunt me until this day. I cannot sleep at night. Every single night, I am awakened in the middle of the night by images, pictures, children, voices, screams, fire. The image of my child burning will never, ever leave me. In my dreams, I can constantly see Mtunzi's small frame dancing in that fire, screaming, calling me, calling his father, asking us to save him. I can see the faces of those monsters laughing, dancing, and singing freedom songs. How can you kill an innocent soul and sing freedom songs? How can they use Mandela's name in vain? They kept on chanting, Nelson Mandel, come and free us. Show us the way. You are the light. Bloody bastards. What has happened to our children? What has happened to our nation? How can we live like this? Huh? How can we raise a bunch of children who don't even have feelings? Who don't even fear death. It's a tragedy. We could not bury Umtunzi because what was left of him was mixed with that burnt tire. And that wire mesh that remains when you burn a tire. Up until this day, I cannot stand the smell of red meat. I want to go home. I'm tired of this place. I'm tired of being here with all of you. I'm tired of the insults. I'm tired of the fake smiles. I'm tired of these stupid games that you play to while away time. I want to go home so that I can fetch my son's spirit and bring him back home. Nimkez, Nimkabelimbuz, so that his soul can rest in peace.